guys, I'm Grace. I'm Jasmine. And we're, we're the, the DIY, DIY Girls. girls. <laughs> All right. If you're new, we hope you consider to subscribe. We love to do crafts. And what else in this channel? Hauls. Hauls, which is usually a... I think we like them both. I was going to say our favorite, but I don't know. And we hope you considered like, subscribe, and hit that button in so you know every time we post a new video. All right, guys, we are excited. We have our first lemon video for this year. There is one, two, three, four, five crafts, and they were all simple and pretty quick to do. And they are so cute. There's like two that are my absolute favorite. I hope you guys can spot those in the video. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and we'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye. Bye. Oh, we have a haul after this video, right? Yeah. All right, I we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye. Okay, so I got one of these frames. This one had some uh, something printed on it is the correct word. And I use my scraper, and I scraped it all off. Okay, so then I went to my Cricut and I found something that says squeeze the day and that is literally what I'm going to put up here. And again, I'm just going to use my hot glue. The, yeah, this is hot glue for real. Uh, my glue stick. And I'm just going to put a ton. I should have probably taken that off, but. Ay, ay, ay. A little late now, but now somehow I printed it bigger, so I need to make sure it's somewhat centered. Now, I don't mind that this is here when it looks like this because I'm not going to hit it. There you go. Look how cute that is. Now, you can leave it like this, but of course, I need a bow would be option one. Let's see, I would make it a whole lot. Make sure your scissors are sharp. There we go. Can't go wrong with my pink scissors. I got another one somewhere. Now, obviously, if you want, you can duct tail them or just keep it like that. I think. So, option one. Or option two. Let's see. And again, these ribbons are all from Dollar Tree. The frame is also from Dollar Tree. I don't know. I think the blue one might be winning. Oh, I have to get my bow up here. Ha -ha. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with this one. I mean this. So. Mm. That's it. I forgot to put on my glue gun. Okay, so here's craft number two. Again, when Easter um, was over, I found a lot of these for like 50 cents. Some were 25 cents. So 
I wanted to make it a lemon because it somewhat has the lemon shape to it. So throughout the whole video, um, I use lemon from Apple Barrel. Now try using lemon, the color first, to cover, paint over it, and it wasn't covering. So I was like, maybe the back, but I was like, no. So we had to decide to paint it white with Waverly, which you can see here. I was seeing if it had a tape to come off, but it didn't. And we had to give it a heavy coat of white paint, let it dry. I think we gave it a second coat of white paint and then we put lemon on the top and i'm just painting a lightly over the orange it's not perfect some of the white ones got a little bit of orange but again i was i scratched some of it off others i left it because again it's not perfect it's cute um you could obviously take off um all the orange ones and if you had yellow ribbon I mean, yellow beads, you could actually um, replace them. But I did not think of that until right now. But that would have been one option. But I think I was trying to do it really fast. So here you see me. Um, again, just using what I had. And then I painted the sides. Um, I added that lemon rib ribbon. And it came from Dollar Tree also. I bought it last year. And then I glued it on top. And then I added some white polka dots on it, which you will see at the end. All right, so I've had these mason jars forever. I had ordered them, I believe, last year from Amazon or something. And obviously, I know Dollar Tree sells them. Those farm fresh words are also from Dollar Tree. And again, I'm using the lemon color and the white Waverly. And I'm uh, painting the words farm fresh. Those stickers were last year from Dollar Tree. I had, oh, I think I picked up like seven of them. <laughs> I have a ton of them. So again, I'm just painting it white and adding it. That burlap ribbon is also from Dollar Tree. And then I just wanted to give it a little bit, something extra. And I glued it on top. Then I just glued it on the back. I used that little dabber from also Dollar Tree. Again, cute. The Farm Fresh does have a little bit of yellow because I wanted to add a little bit of a kind of like a shade or something. And then she was painting some of the lemons also. Now they do have a sticker in the back, but I, again, they're from last year and I really wanted to make sure they didn't come off. I had her put it wherever she wanted. And then that's it. That ribbon, I bought it this year, earlier on in the year. It's also from Dollar Tree. And again, it's not uh, wired, so it makes it a little more difficult to work with. But again, a lot of tugging and pulling, and I duct tail the end. And we're just trying to figure out where we're going to put it. Again, she had the whole idea for this uh, craft, so I just let her go with it. Again, I don't know what I'm doing off on the other side. Sorry there, guys. What did I do? Duct tail them more. Okay, and then I had glued it. We're trying to figure out, do we put it on the top? Do we put it on the side? So we did finally decided on the side, or she. <laughs> now, I wanted mine to stand up. So, again, I got the little tower um, stackable. These were the big ones. They're not the little ones. And I just put it on the bottom. And um, we're just holding it so that it stands up. And that's it. All right. This is craft number four already. Holy moly. We're going fast. So here, again, she had the whole idea of this. So again, that lemon from Apple Barrel painting that whole this disc also or that round shape is also from Dollar Tree. I'm just painting. Well, she's painting that uh, yellow. And this is a sky blue. It's also from Apple Barrel. And that color of shade is absolutely beautiful. So again, I just gave it a good coat of it. Then I, we hot glued it to the center. Obviously, you can see that ours was still wet when it um, marked a little bit of the yellow. But again, it's going to go back up on top and cover it. And now we were going to add beads. It's the first time we make our own beads <laughs> from the beginning to the end. So I used that same ribbon that is there. 
or did I say that it came with? And I did white, light blue, white, light blue. And one, two, three, four, five, six on each side. Again, I used the same ribbon I had used from before and the same stickers. And that is it. Again, I glued the ribbon on the top. She painted two of the yellow lemons. Again, those were the stickers from last year. And that's about it. Oh, and then at the end, we decided to do a little, um, a light, because it doesn't come out dark, but just enough to give it a little bit of dimensions, the circles, lines around the sides, as you can see here. And this craft is done. All right, so this one is craft number five. Again, the eggs from Easter and those little wheels that they, I had those from last year. And all I did was trace where that um, wheel or sailing thingy called. Make sure you have really, really sharp scissors. These are from the hardware store, like Lowe's or Home Depot. And they're meant for like industrial thing. So it's not a regular scissor. And again, carefully cutting everything on the side. And that reminded me, if you guys don't like the little circles on the top and the bottom, to me, they kind of reminded me of seeds. Um, you can definitely co cover them up with um, that white thing from Dollar Tree. OMG. All right. And again, I just painted. And again, I don't care. It's not perfect because, again, it's not, um, it's not supposed to be perfect. Lemons are not perfect, right? And then I painted the wheel part white. And that's pretty much it for like the outside. Then again, I strung my own beads with some white twine I've had for a while. It might be even from Dollar Tree. That's how long I've had it. Um, and then I just glued it to the top. And the string I attached it to that, uh, the little hole on the top. I did one with a string and one without a string because just to have them a little different. I had some yellow and white ribbon. This also came from Dollar Tree. This one was from the spring because I think it has like little, it's a plaid one. Okay. I thought it was the one that had little flowers, but no, I think that one's a little darker. And then I just glued the string to the top or the bottom. And that's it I think it came out so cute and so simple yes you can sand down the sides and make it uh, a little more perfect but again I absolutely love the ways the these came out uh, let me see if you guys can figure out which one was Jasmine's favorite and we have after this another haul video for you guys and then we will have another uh, lemon video let me know down in the comments below which one do you think is jasmine's favorite she said she had two and let's see if they are the same um if they're your favorite as well all right guys we hope you like subscribe and hit that notification button so you're notified every time we post a new video all right guys we'll see you on the next one bye, bye. <laughs> oh brother all right guys enjoy i like them all actually i don't know which one's my favorite hmm i think that